Yes, I had a great history teacher in the 11th grade and all the other kids hated him. They hated him, but he wasn't mean. He was just tough. And what I loved about him, he was Socratic. And what I learned from him was if you liked President Lincoln he, and you would say, I like President Lincoln, he would come at you with 50 reasons to hate him. But if you said, I don't like President Lincoln, he would come at you with 50 reasons why I had to love him. He made me think that you can't just say something. You have to have reasons. And that was very powerful because years later, when I teach my students, there's an expression we use in my classroom. You know, when children are doing a project, they love to say, I'm done. And that's dirty words in my classroom because I always ask the kids, when are we done? And they have to answer, never. When you finish a book, there's the next book. When you finish a math project, you're never done learning math. You're never done learning geography. So the other thing that I learned from him, we're so focused on the end result. But I think the journey is far more important than the destination. And as a teacher of 32 years, I'm just getting warmed up. This is just part of a long journey, and I'm better now than I was 30 years ago, and I'm going to be better in 30 years because I keep learning.